Shaber 1000 here. Today we're at Homa Sassa Springs. We're at a wildlife park. And right behind me, right over there, they're going to be feeding the manatees here in a little bit. So we're going to go check that out and I'm going to film some of that for you. But in the meantime, we're going to just go ahead and walk around and wait. So hopefully you enjoy this video. Just kind of an afternoon outing on a Saturday. Next Saturday is going to be fun, so stick around for that. So here we go. He's 59 years old, I think. Yeah. 57. Yeah. He originally came from California. Yeah. Which is all on the which I showed you. And you guys can freeze it. It's quite impressive. That's pretty cool. He's eating. He's hungry. Okay, so this hippopotamus is an honorary citizen of Florida. His name is Lou, the hippopotamus. Hippos live 40 to 50 years in the wild. Captive hippos can live to the age of 60 years or more. You guys can uh, pause this if you want to read it. I know it's kind of small, but cool. But there he is, that's Lou. It says, that he to maintain his size and weight Lou consumes 15 pounds of alfalfa four scoops of herbivore diet food and five gallon buckets of fruit and vegetables every day each January oh his birthday's in January Aww. so it's my birthday each January on his birthday Lou receives a special birthday cake. Local school children attend his party. Cool. He was born at the San Diego Zoo in 1960. He's been a re resident. He's been here since 1964. In his youth, Lou was part of Ivan tours animal actors and starred on television and in movies so he's a famous hippo okay guys can you see him? have the American alligator here there's another one over there along on that bank right there But we see them a lot bigger than this on our river. Pretty cool, huh? Alright, let's go check the other one out. And here's the other gator that we seen from over there. There's the first one we looked at. Right over there he is. And we got this guy right here. So he's tail laying in the water. I want to wrestle one of them, but monkey won't let me. And we got there's Lou. He was cutting half or something, but dropped right in the arm. And he ended up in his 
Back over in there, there's some more animals. I just seen a deer run across. Get monkey and see if she wants to go check these animals out. So, so there's Lou. Alright, let's go check out some more stuff. He moved here in 64. Little hippo. <laughs> Time to move. Here we found a turtle on the tree there, hanging out. Pretty cool. <laughs> We're trying to make our way to the manatees, and then we'll do some more after that, after they do the feeding. Cool. And over here, if you can see, there's all kinds of little birds in here. Big birds. There's some there. This is cute. It's like a little zoo in a state park. There's a manatee. Yeah, bleachers here, you can see it. So, we'll get up closer. pretty cool. Best we can. We'll bring you up closer. Yeah. How big that tail is. Beautiful shot there. In January is usually when they get really cold, and you'll cut probably this will be full. Mm -hmm. And uh, see all the things. Big get thing. Which would be cool. Just hanging out right there. Awesome. Big tail. Very graceful. What do they call them? Uh, sea potatoes, right? Yeah. Sea cows. Sea cows? Yeah, that's what was called. Like, somebody called them potatoes or something. Uh, Live? There he is. Pretty cool. 
Big school of fish over there. This is where you can go now. I did my intro right over there. Cool. Beautiful down here. There's some deep water. Got some little springs running out there. Big giant fish. There, look at him. He's probably 36, 37 inches long. At least. There's another fish right below him, see? Oop. It's scaring him. <laughs> cool. He was fast. I got mm -hmm. only a glimpse of him. There's some more. There he oh, is. A big one. Yeah, he's huge. <laughs> there he is. Whee! <laughs> yeah, where are the giraffes? They used to have them years ago. Where are the giraffes? Where's the Oh! He moved his tail. Whoa, he's so big. He is big. Two, two tons. It's thousands and thousands of pounds. Oh, they eat lettuce. And the fish is open. Aren't they pretty fish? Mm -hmm. Those are pretty fish. The same thing is open. Elephant. Yeah. 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 Elephant. Saturday afternoon. And right over here. Where is he? Right there. There he is. Foxes, Mama. Yeah, there's two of them in here. Because we went to two of them. And there's the foxes. Yeah, there's the fox. The wolves weren't out, so. Good looking animals. One of them is Swiper the fox. Where'd you find the other one? There's two of them. Back there. Oh, okay, I see. Hmm? Way back there. Cool. The other one. Not sure which one's which, but one of them's called Swiper the Fox. Oh yeah? Yeah. So we're gonna find we're gonna try to find the cats and the bears. Look, look, look. Yeah. That's what Do you know there are more fake flamingos in Florida than there are real flamingos? Yeah? Yep, for real. Huh. Well, where do they originally come from? I don't know. Hmm. But I do know there's more fake them fake flamingos than there are real flamingos in Florida. 
A little tighter shot for you here. Got one drinking. Okay, cool. This one, where's he at? <laughs> I missed the drama. And this one is sleeping. Got some buzzards over here. A really cool place. But there's the family of flamingos. See, he's standing on his one foot. One family of them. So I just happened to see Monkey pointing her camera up in the tree there. And a bunch of buzzards up there. Death birds. Okay, so we're coming up to the owl, owls. We got the barn owl. We got the barred owls and Caracurus. See? Hi, owls. How are you? These are the barn owls. They're pretty cool. Now this owl, owl here is like the one we've seen in the backyard, remember I was filming him? They are here because the barn owls are a pair. They may be a pair of visitors, damaged wings, or foot injuries. These types are injuries. Well, they have injuries. Hunting. Those ones Success over there. So these are here. And these are barred owls. So. They're very pretty. I got you in my backyard. This one's the one we had in the backyard, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. A barred owl. Yeah. Cool. Oh, he looked right at me. And we was about that close to him where I was. And here we've got some whooping cranes. Right there. The whooping, whooping cranes. And that's how they kind of rest. Cool. Check this guy out. We got him hamming it up for the camera. I am not zoomed in. See? They're zoomed in. And this is all the way out. About four feet from him. Let me see if I can tell you what's wrong with this eagle. <laughs> In the 1960s, the bald eagle population decreased dramatically due to harmful chemical DDT. But we see them flying over our house a lot. Unfortunately, each of our eagles had, they've had wing injuries. Come on, you get it! That required amputation. Oh, so their wing wings have been hurt and amputated that's why they cannot fly out of here it's beautiful actually i seen one of these over at a golf course uh, one time fly down there was a pond there fly down and get him a fish it was so majestic and so beautiful when when it did that and over here we have the red-tailed hawk. And they can't fly away because like I said, they've been, they've been wounded. Um, this thing, this guy here, he's, he don't live here. He just comes in. But yeah, that's the red-tailed hawk. We have them in Ohio, they're beautiful too. Okay, guys, here we go. We have a bear back there walking around. 
I did see one out in the wild one time. It was it was better than that one though, but not by much. But still, he was like 20 feet away from me. But. So that's cool. It looks like is that a painting on that building yet. Yeah. So anyway, there's the bear. They're supposed to have um mountain lions here, a type of mountain lion that are very rare. They're endangered here in Florida. So we're gonna find them, but there's one of the bears, a shea bear. <laughs> And my daughter bear, Shauna bear. <laughs> cool. Monkey will be glad to see this one. Oh, I think he's wanting now. Maybe he's hungry. <laughs> kind of hard to focus. It's trying to focus on the Look at that view. So, monkey just seen a kitty cat, as she called it. And there it is, right over there. Let's go get a better look at him. I suppose that bug cat's here, too. Yeah. Let's go in here. This is the picture of the Florida Panther. Florida Panther. That's what she is. The Puma. 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 Let's see. There it is. There's one back there in the cage. She came out of her car. Right there. When she came out of her car, the Panther was right there. And the reason why is because they have birds bounced not far from there, and she figures they can fly. Yeah, they'll get the they are very rare. They are down here, but they're very, very rare. Oh, now you want to pet the kitty? That one's facing too, so the other one's in. No, you brought me all the way back here. Now I'm feeding you the kitty. Laying. Harley, it's not real. And it's not real. Well, then you have that one there. Oh, that's a panther. Cool. Yep, you got two of them. And again, there's the one back there in the cage, looking around. Hi. Isn't this cute? I guess that's a donation thing? Yeah. That's cute. And then they got their little panther. So right over there, we're heading over this direction. Or the bobcats. So we'll go check them out. We have bobcats in Ohio, and I lived in a little village called Buffalo, which is not far from Seneca Lake, Ohio. But I, uh, there was a bobcat attacking my dog. I had a little dog named Petey. And there was a bobcat about that size was attacking my dog. So I had to shoot the bobcat. I didn't want to because I don't shoot anything I don't eat. But I mean, is either that or let him kill my dog. And wasn't going to happen. He's just a tiny little doggy. So there's the bobcats. A good side view of him there. Let's come around here. <laughs> Monkey called them the babies. A Florida bobcat. Yeah, there you are. See his ears? Fun fact, my high school, our what do you call him? Our mascot was a bobcat. Was a bobcat. So we were the Cambridge Bobcats. 
And it tells a little bit about them. I don't know if you guys can see that. So, I am actually a bobcat. There's one, he's just sitting there looking. Can you see him? Let's see if I can zoom in here. Try to shot. See, it's trying to it's trying to focus on the uh, fence, but there he is, sitting there looking around. Cool. I wanted the mountain lion thing to do do the scream that they do. And this is just a place where birds and flamingos and stuff can go and hang out and in this area here. I wanted to see the reptiles, but ooh. they were playing. Yeah, I seen them. He went that way, and the other one couldn't find them. <laughs> and then he ran and chased them. <laughs> I was telling him you called these the babies. Yeah, these are babies. But I'm a bobcat. Uh, yeah, right. fun fact. Well, you're tiny. My high school, we were the Cambridge Bobcats. Ah. Uh, where'd the other one go? He's hiding behind that box, I think. Again. There's an otter in here somewhere. Have you seen? I saw him kind of, but I didn't get him on film. Hear that electric fence? Yeah. Look, they mean business. Not sure where he is, but this is a cool fence. But the otters are supposed to be in here. They must be able to lay back here. This separates the otters. Oh, is this closed off? Yeah, they can't. The otters can't get through here. Oh, okay. Well, I thought maybe we could see an otter. I was hoping he'd get up there on that platform, but... Well, I'm not sure where the otter is. But I thought this was a cool bridge. All aluminum. But, oh well. We missed the otters. Let's go. See what's, I'm not sure what's over there, the deer walk. Um, we saw the deer earlier, but we can't. They got that closed off. So, see what's in here. Oh, we got the tortoises. There's a tortoise right there. Oh, and an owl. I don't know if I can. There's the owl. And right down here is the tortoise. If I can get in through that fence. But he's a pretty big sized tortoise. He goes in that hole down there. But yeah, there's one of them. Oh, he's looking at us. See that? There he is. It's pretty cool. Supposed to have reptiles here, so I don't know. I'd like to see the reptiles. But he won't fly out. Well, the owl won't. I know the, the tortoise won't. He definitely won't, but they got that up there to keep the owl in. He's a burrowing owl. And that is the gopher turtle. Must have just fed him. That's his food over there. So that's pretty cool. Oh no, the reptile exhibit is closed. Maybe they'll have one here. Yeah, there's one. There's a snake. See? Mm. 
hang back in there. Here's his tail. Bet I gotta do this through glass. I'm sorry. I don't know if there's anything on this other side or not. Monkey won't want to see this. She don't like them. Cute little house, but I don't. I don't see the snake in this one. Yeah, I do. There it is. Right there. There's the snake. I can't tell you what they are because, wait, here it is. The Gulf Hammock Rat Snake. I've seen these in the backyard. Let's see what the other one is. Um, the other one is a Florida Pine Snake. Now I have not seen one of these in a while yet, but at least I know what it is now. So. Maybe that'll help. Oh, there you go. So we got to see two snakes. I didn't bring any cash. Maybe monkey. I can talk monkey into if I can find her. There she is over there on the bridge looking for the otters. That's what that little red ball over there is for. Oh, and we have a a bird sitting there. Photo bombing us. That little ball is for the otters to play with. I think she's looking for the otters. She's over there on the bridge. <clears throat> What's around here? Restricted area. Well, that's okay. We we got to see some animals today. There's monkey walking over there. What? The otters? No, did you? Did you? He came up? Was he? So I did talk monkey into getting this soda pop. She said, ooh, soda machine. So. Cool. Yeah, but maybe your viewers do. Let's get one of these. If you guys can see how big he is. It's clear back up in that corner. Yeah, look at that. I don't know if you guys can see him. There he is right there. Goes all the way to the corner and he goes all the way behind this little tree thing. You can see him there. And he still, and he's curled up over here. Yep. So he's friggin' long. He's, he's probably about five feet. He's pretty long. Mm hmm I have not seen one of these yet. This is called a full Florida pine snake. Where's his head? I just noticed his head right back here. Oh, there it is. There's his head. Yep. Wow. He hears us. He's like, yeah, go away, leave me alone. Wow. Really cool. It is cool, but from a distance. Beautiful. I don't find it beautiful. This is a different one. That's another one down there. Oh, is there two in there? Yeah, because the other one, see the difference in the color? Oh, you sure? Yeah. See, look at the other one. There's more white. Uh -huh. This one's got more black on it. See? So there's two in here. Uh-huh. He looks friendly. Yeah. yeah sure. He just wants there, a hug, Kimmy. There's another one over there, curled up, too. Yeah, there is. Oh, oh he's, he's out. He was behind me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was more into the soda. I didn't know. Oh, look at him. No. <laughs> he's trying to say I'm hi. I'm so glad he's in there and not out oh, here. Yeah, me too. Uh, I can't stand him. I hate him. <laughs> I went to Bush Gardens once with my, my dad and my parents. And 
They did that picture with the, the boa. Oh, yeah, no. I had that thing wrapped around my leg, up and around, and my oh, dad no. held the head. <laughs> I would never, ever do it again. No. Ever. And I had a pair of shorts on then. I'm no. like, oh. That's a big snake. <laughs> yeah, I was scared to death. You showing up? Is that a female? I don't know. It looks female, doesn't it? I don't know. How can you tell by his face? You got to check back here at the cloaca, which is right in there. See, this is not his tail. His tail is actually from right about here. No. And the cloaca is right in this area. That's how you tell male from female. You come to see us? Huh? You want some visitors? You've been quarantined, here, huh? Touch, touch no. him. I did Come that here, one. Touch that. It, no. Touch the glass. You can feel them. No, you can't. It's yeah, glass. Can, touch the glass. You can feel them. No. Touch nah, the glass. I, I just. I don't have my in me. I'll Come be on. dreaming about it, and I will never Let's sleep do it. again. No. You can't feel them through glass. Look. I have soda. Here, you want a soda? You want the soda? Huh? Come on, touch the glass. Please for the camera. Really? Yeah, do it for YouTube. Really? Okay, YouTube, she's going to touch the glass. This is going to be is. as quick as it. Just touch the glass. You can't feel him. Okay, I touch it. Good job. <laughs> Did you feel him? No. Okay, see? But I didn't do it just then. <laughs> Bye. Oh, okay. don't do that. That's not nice. Oh, come on. Here. So anyway, there's that one and there's the other one back there. So, so you cool. can't use cash at the soda machine. Okay guys, so here's a wild animal. Not part of the show, but he joined uh, in. We got a squirrel. There he is. Pretty cool. Oh, it's closed. There he is. There's the otter. He cute. some ducks, wild ducks out there. There's, there's a manatee over there. And there's one over here. There's a manatee. And right over right in, there's another one. That's a manatee. Yeah, it was just, just over there. Yeah. There's another one over here. See him? There's two in there. Yeah. This is the Homosassa River. We need to bring our boat out here. This is where we're no, not this one. No, we won't be over here? No, we're going to be on that real weird name one. Oh. And fish down there. Look how shallow it is. Oh, there's some faces. Hi, faces. <laughs> they got these you can look out, but. We got some great zooms on our cameras, so. <clears throat> oh, honey. Things are huge. Save the manatees. Loving things. Big old sea cows. Awesome. We're going to continue on this way. But again, like I said, there's 
Homosassa River. I'm sure we'll have our boat on here sooner or later. Okay guys, so in this pen here, we got some freshwater turtles. There's one with his head up out right there. Yeah, this one here is this, see, right there. Uh-huh. Look, right down here. That's a, that's, I think it's a leather bag. Hi. Yeah, see? I see you. Who's Look, they think we got head. stuff. Yeah, that's what it is. I think they think we're going to feed them. <laughs> Look at them. They got all their heads up. That's funny. You're that funny guys. Yes, you are. You're funny guys. Yeah, he's a pretty good size in there. Mm hmm. Hmm? They're pushing each other. The other one's over there. It's like, I'm out. Oh, there's one there. Kind of camouflage with rocks. Mm -hmm. I'll back up so you can get them. Hey guys, here's some turtles. Yeah, I wasn't going to take them because Shaver has it on his, and then we saw these two, and they were sitting just right there on the bank. Here comes another one. He's sitting there. They think we're going to feed them, and they all came up. Cool. They're probably used to getting bread and stuff all day. Yeah. That's pretty neat. This whole pond. This is supposed to be fresh water turtles? Yes, these are all fresh water turtles. That's pretty cool. You're smoking. I bet it's supposed to be a fountain. Yeah. Yeah, probably. <laughs> but it looks like you're smoking. There you go. They told Shaberry he couldn't smoke in here. And the man is he's smoking. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> well, we really think what it is. Cool. This place is nice, though. I mean, wish you got more for your money. But, like Monkey said, at least they're, they're taking care of the animals. So. We came over that bridge there. No, I don't even know if you can see it. The bridge there. And we made a big loop around this building. So, this is the Garden of the Springs Discovery Center. Of course, it's closed. But, that's okay. Like I said, at least they're, they're feeding, you know, they're feeding the animals. So. Cool.
right, so there you go. This is uh, Homosassa Springs Wildlife Park. It's two thumbs up. It'd be a lot better when everything gets opened back up again. But there's donation boxes around. You can put your money in and help feed the animals uh, like the eagles and those kind of birds. They're wounded. They'll never be able to be out in the wild again. So that helps them out, take care of them. So anyway, we're going to get out of here. It's been a wonderful afternoon. I like it here. Uh, We'll definitely be back again. So, anyway, guys, if you're on the home SAS area, be sure to drop in and check this place out. It's pretty awesome. So, we'll see you guys soon. Shea Bear, Myth Man, a Legend. I'm out for now. Monkey's going to do her outro out front. We're going to go through the gift shop and out to the truck, and we're going to be gone with it. We'll see you guys soon. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Bye bye and take care.